morning and welcome to the vlog. My name is Clarissa and we are our friend circus and we're gonna have a great day. Let's have our coffee and then we can start cleaning and decorating for Easter. But the first thing I'm gonna do is throw in some laundry and switch it over. We always have laundry every day in this house and I'm sure a lot of you can relate to that too. Um, but I also wanted to introduce myself if any of you are new. My name is Clarissa and I am a mom to three. I love Ray Dunn. I love decorating. I love cleaning and just keeping my house tidy. Um, and just sharing my everyday life, fun things I'm doing with my kids. So if you're interested in that, make sure you join our YouTube family. Now we're gonna get some of these dishes done and clean up the kitchen and then we can get some of our decorations out.
the new Scentsy Warmer that I got for springtime and I'm so excited to have that right there and it's going to make my whole house smell so amazing. cute that looks I love this bath and body work candle look at the top of it it looks like a bunny nose it smells so good I got my salt and pepper and my swimming brush right there which is always nice but just enough and it'll be easy to move when I need to use my stove before I sleep hear the crickets see the moon side by side and through and through no limit to what we Hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy But things are finally right I just did this little counter for the counter down, countdown to Easter for the kids. Um, I like how that little area turned out. It just wraps its way around. Got the kids special egg plates. I have four of them. I'm going to stick them up here so we can use them until Easter. Guys, so I just hung up these reeds and I wanted them to be a little bit lower this year. So I put some command hooks on the glass. Hopefully they hold. I really like the way that that turned out. I got those last year at Family Dollar. They do have a lot of great stuff. If you're looking for things, you should go check them out. But I just love the way my kitchen turned out, and I can't wait for the kids to come home and see.
I just put a few little Easter eggs. And then up here on the mantle, I put my happy Easter right on sign. And this is more cutesy for the kids, but I have this really cute musical bunny from Hallmark and our egg lights that we like to turn on at night. And then here we have the Easter Bunny key for when he comes to visit. And we have this little candy dish over here that's a little chick. But that is what we have on our mantle. Guys, and I just added a few little things for spring in here in the bathroom. So I have this hello spring hand towel that's light pink. Um, ready done, of course. I have another one of those to go downstairs in the girls' bathroom. And then I just added a little bunny over here and our happy Easter soap. So that is what I did in the bathroom. For and I also put that hand towel downstairs in the girls' bathroom. And I went outside and I did a little bit of decorating out there. Um, I'm so glad it was a nice day today. Hey guys, so I've been cleaning and decorating for Easter and I'm going to make dinner now and I'm going to do a homemade pizza. My kids really love this and it's a super easy um, crust recipe, so let's make it together. My rapid yeast packet in the bowl. Then I'm going to be adding my one cup of warm water. Okay, so I have one cup of warm water in with my rapid yeast. And then I'm going to add a teaspoon of salt. A teaspoon of salt. A teaspoon of sugar, white sugar. And one fourth cup of oil. And two and a half cups of flour. Blend it together and form your pizza crust. You'll want to put it on in a pizza stone or a pizza pan, cookie sheet, whatever you have. You might want to put a little bit of cornstarch down, but we're just going to form this into some dough. Now you might want to add a little bit more flour right here, depending on how sticky it is. Now you're gonna wanna let it rise for at least an hour. The dough is quite big now and I am going to make two pizzas out of it. So once you get your pizza made, you're going to have your oven on 425 and you're going to bake for about 20 minutes. Um, just check it. Sometimes it might need to be in there for a little longer depending on how thick your crust is. But this is such a family favorite, super easy to make, and super delicious. If you try this recipe, make sure you go tag me over on Instagram at rfunsearch.
wait until you can make some of these bunny waffles. They're done and they look amazing. They smell so good. This one is half cheese, half pepperoni. And then this one has pineapple and pepperoni on it. Super, super good. And you can't wait to have dinner. Pizza yummy? Hot. Mmm. It's yummy, mommy. isn't it? It's yummy. Yeah, it is. Oh that my. so good. Mommy. Oh my goodness. Mommy, mommy. It's yummy. It's yummy? Here, yeah. get another bite. Here. Oh my yummy. goodness. I gotta make this again, don't I? It's delicious. Yeah. It is so good. Was it because yeah. you helped me? Is that why it's so good? Yeah. The pizza was delicious. I hope you enjoyed cleaning and decorating with me today, and I hope you got some ideas for around your house, or maybe you cleaned and decorated right along with me. But anyways, it was such a great day spending it with you guys, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye!